We are in Porto. Where they make port. So we're gonna drink some port because we're in Porto. Where they make port. Hey, yeah. Porto? Porto Loco? What's the deal, Johan? I don't know where to do this. Oh, okay, there you go. Do we all go in? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not working. I tried to walk through and it didn't like nah, me. Don't worry, don't worry. Take your time, don't stress yourself. At 2 o'clock I'll be calling you. <laughs> then just enjoy the tour and the tasting at the end. Take that, all the photos you want. That film. sounds fantastic. Alright, so I've got a tour of the well, old I love winery. How he was like, are you English? Like, the stupid English people can't work, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can't, work can't work out how to scan yeah. a barcode, eh? <laughs> Look at these amazing vines we've come across. Landscape is beautiful. We're really high up. Yeah, it's a really good viewpoint from up here. We climbed this really big hill to get this amazing view. That's where we are. That's where all the wine is. Well, the wine's here now, but that's where all the wine came from. Why doesn't my family tree look like that? Funny thing is, I didn't actually know you could get white port. Yeah, I only found that out today as well. Port wine can be white. I thought port wine was only like really deep red wine, but turns out it's not. Apparently it's like whiskey and stuff, like the longer you leave it, the better it is. Oh, whoa, whoa. okay. So this is right. the oldest one in their cellar, and mm. it's only, there's only eight bottles remaining. It's not for sale. Look at that, they're all dirty and old. I wonder what, like, it'd be good to taste like, a normal one and then taste like the really old one and see if yeah but to do that you have to pay like hundreds or thousands of dollars and i don't think it's worth hundreds or thousands of dollars no but i'm that meaning like if someone gave it to you for free it'd be interesting <laughs> a chocolate? chocolate? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah we all smell and then we all guess <gasps> coffee what no Coffee. I was right. What? And you guys told yeah. me, no, you're wrong. Oh. Never listen to a man. Alright, let's go. Oh, I totally know what that is, but I... Toilet spray. <laughs> it's like strawberry it's berries, yes. smell it. Blackberry. Blackberry. Not licorice. Raspberry. Oh. Vanilla. Vanilla. Come on, baby. Come Vanilla. on, baby. Come on, baby. Yeah. yeah, we got one. A little too excited for this. Everyone's just sitting there cruising. The entirety of this vat production, we will have 74,000 bottles. Time to, time to taste some more. First, we go downstairs, wider at the bottom, and narrower step, or by the base. Don't do it like this. With some vigor, with some strength. Oh, with some strength. We, are, we are allowing the oxygen to the wine. So, is this smell it again? And tell me if you can find a difference. Yeah. 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 Wow, that is very sweet. She said, take it. a sip and then. Swirl it every time you take a sip. We've learned that it's a dessert wine, of course. We don't have any dessert to drink with it. We need some like, yeah. crackers. <laughs> Tell me what it smells like. <laughs> no, really, and then ah, give it a what does it smell like? <laughs> then I lose it. Over. <laughs> oh, it doesn't do it as much as the last one. It smells a little bit different, but this one, as soon as I whipped it, it's like, whoa. Yeah, it like <laughs> <laughs> mm. Whoa. Got a bit of a twang. Oh, well, that was a fantastic little wine tour. And this is like the coolest looking town ever, by the way. If you haven't been to Porto or seen Porto, check this out. This is like, this is like one of the coolest looking towns that we've been to so far, I think. Just with the river running right through the heart of the city. Right? I'm like How giving... How cool is this town? Yeah, I'm, oh, I'm giving Porto big props. It's like one of the nicest places that we've seen thus far. If uh, Rio Maggiore in Italy was a city, I think it would be like this. Like this.
Nope. Cheers to Porto. Yay, hey, we're in Porto and we're drinking beer. Fun fact about Porto, the houses over there are like half of the price as the houses over here. And I feel like if you lived over there and you looked at this, this looks, this side looks better. We're in Porto right now, over there is like another town, which is just across that bridge. There's a bridge over there, you just cross the bridge and you're in a place, Gaia. Yeah. Gaia is like half the price of Porto. Like We're our, thinking about staying here. Our apartment um, is 100 New Zealand a night for weekend price. It's 100 a night. Whereas normal week price was like 68 New Zealand a night on Airbnb. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms, huge balcony right on the waterfront. Beautiful view. Real nice, huge apartment. And then here, over this side? Over this side you get like a little apartment one bedroom maybe for 200 a night it's weird i think some people love living in the city i guess ease of living in the city cheers to porto we do love it here and we are going to come back for sure i think we're going to be dragged back here next year These guys just gave me some snaps. Well, I just brought them, but look at them. Look. So you peel it just like this. So it helps, stuff sticks to it. There you go, try it. Tastes like potato, dried potato. Oh, you. Taking a mess. Verdict, those nuts are good. They're flame grilled nuts. Don't know if you're just meant to eat the burnt. I don't know. 